Hello everyone, this is here on the Welcome back to my playthrough of The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening DX for the Game Boy Color. Previously, we cleared the Color Dungeon and got Link the Red Clothes, doubling his offensive power. We've also completed all eight dungeons and acquired all eight instruments of the Sirens. Now it's time to see if we can wake up the Windfish. We'll also need this, Dark Secrets and Mysteries of Koholint. Do you really want to read it? This requires the magnifying glass. Round and round, the passageways of the egg. Right up, up, right up, up, right up. Hmm? This book reeks of secrets. Yes, so it does. Link, someday you will leave this island. I just know it. In my heart. Don't ever forget me. If you do, I'll never forgive you. How could I ever forget you, Marin? Now it's time to head to that egg. Resting on the far northern mountain. And a guardian acorn. Fantastic! We're heading to Tamaranch Mountain. Right up here. Mount Tamaranch. And here we are. And we need the Song of the Windfish from Marin. And concert time! Very lovely. And it's cracked open. The time has come. The windfish awaits. Enter the egg. Oot! Oot! Very well, mysterious one. Windfish's egg. And we have to drop in. Delightful. And then we have to follow the directions we found in that book. East. North. North. East. North twice again. East once more. And then north. Here we are. Let's just drop in. We were born of nightmares. To take over this world, we made the windfish sleep endlessly. If the windfish doesn't wake up, this island will never disappear. We would have been the masters of this place, but you had to come here and disrupt our plans. Hehe. <laughs> you can never defeat us. Let's rumble. Yes, let's rumble. 
Time for a bit of a boss rush. Starting with a dark blob. Weak to powder. Next up. It's a Godem from A Link to the Past. We'll have to deflect these spherical energy balls right back at him. Take that, Aghanim. We want to avoid that one. Next up... A Moldorm. Weak in the tail. Next up... Ah, uh, it's Ganon. We want to dash into this guy. And avoid his fire bats. Take that, Ganon. Certainly easier than the original. Now we need the magic rod against that guy. A land mola. Finally, the main event. Death hole. We have to avoid its arms. Not too hard with the rock's feather. And then shoot it in the eye. It's practically a one-hit kill with the boomerang. But with the bow, it's more of a challenge. Yes, I see you. Now he's starting to adjust the angle of his opening. I have you right where you want me. This island is going to disappear. Our world is going to disappear. Our world! Our world! Goodbye, Deathel. Link, you have beaten all the nightmares. Climb the stairs before you. Alrighty. Ah, uh, a stairway. Well, this is interesting. Ah, hello. Oot, young lad, I mean. Link, the hero. You have defeated the nightmares. You have proven your wisdom, courage, and power. As part of the Windfish's spirit, I am the guardian of his dream world. But one day... The nightmares entered the dream and began wreaking havoc. Then you, Link, came to rescue the island. I have always trusted in your courage to turn back the nightmares. Thank you, Link. My work is done. 
The wind fish will wake soon. Goodbye. Oot. Goodbye, Mr. Owl. See you in Ocarina of Time. And this must be the wind fish. Hello there. I am the wind fish. Long has been my slumber. In my dreams, an egg appeared and was surrounded by an island with people, animals, an entire world. But verily, it be the nature of dreams to end. When I dost awaken, Koholint will be gone. Only the memory of this dream, land will exist in the waking world. Some day, thou may recall this island. That memory must be the real dream, world. Come, Link, let us awaken. Together. Fantastic, Mr. Fishy. Play the eight instruments. Play the Song of Awakening. Time for the concert to begin again. Kind of sad. As the song is played, the island disappears. Goodbye, Marin. And there goes the entire island. <laughs> Blasted out by a geyser of water, eh? Hello, seagulls. Ah, he's at the wreckage of his boat again. I hear the song. And it's the wind fish. Not bad for an old Game Boy game. Pretty good, in fact. And sorry again about the flickering text. Not sure if it's the emulator or what. But quite a good game. Definitely makes good use of the battle system from A Link to the Past, which in itself is an extension of the original Zelda system. It does get a little old having to switch between weapons all the time, but then again there were only two real buttons on the original Game Boy. A and B, and of course start and select. And they did a good job with the music as well. 
Hello there, Mr. Windfish. The story does get a little weird, even for a Zelda game. But then again, it is a dream world. And I guess just about anything goes in a dream. Yes, Koji Kondo. The original Zelda composer. As well as Mario. And of course, Mr. Miyamoto. The end. And there is a little more. If you got through the game without losing any lives. We can see Marin in the sky. But it's just a seagull. The development team would like to thank you for playing. And I would like to thank you for watching. In the next episode, I'll show off the, f the finishing of the photography side quest. This is Hey Rotlinia. I'd like to thank you for watching, and I'll see you again next time.